Hello, this is Art Johnson with New World Communications here near Seattle, actually in the city of Bothell. And I'm here to um, introduce to you the New World Learning Institute and Conference Center. This is an amazing capability. It's actually a virtual conferencing and trade show capability, virtual learning in real time as well as on demand that um, we are providing the world um, basically as a service to essentially help people and organizations enjoy the benefit of doing a local, regional, uh, or even a global conference uh, using technology that is at low cost or even no cost um, for a phenomenal benefit and to completely democratize the whole conferencing situation. You know, I worked with a client recently um, in the uh, Washington State area, and one of the things that I learned is that less than 10% of a total possible audience can afford to attend physical world conferences and trade shows because of the hotel, the travel, the time away from their physical location. Um, and so the nature of what can be shared um, is not as good because it doesn't include more people, more stakeholders in that. So that's a 90% opportunity. Uh, so you could be the smallest solopreneur, you could be a nonprofit, a grassroots nonprofit even, or you could be a large nonprofit, like a national nonprofit that um, can really, really benefit by adding this capability. Now, we're not taking anything away. We can, we can even, if you've already invested in doing a, um, a physical world conference and trade show, we can add revenue to that by adding this component to that so that you would actually have a net new revenue stream that other dipping into that other 90%. We're not guaranteeing that 90% of people are going to immediately jump into doing this, but just even a little bit more revenue could leverage that and give you more net revenue for doing your event. I know how tight this is um, to do this, and so this is just a wonderful capability that I'm doing. So uh, I'd like to kind of talk about the core things that you would do at any kind of a conference, whether it's physical world or virtual world, and just show you how we're doing this online with the, the suite of low-cost and no-cost cloud-based technologies. So I'm going to go ahead and do a screen share. I'm actually doing this as a Hangout on Air, by the way, over Google+, Plus. which, by the way, I, I would like to say a few things about Google+, Plus and also about this platform. Google+, Plus is a probably the world's fastest-growing um, social platform despite of whatever misinformation that you're hearing, <laughs> it is actually amazing. In, le in little over than three years, it has over 540 million active users. It's owned by Google. It also goes directly to, um, it can go directly to your smartphone, whether it's an iPhone or whether it's an Android phone. Google owns 80% of the world market in mobile. So, I mean, even if you don't even have a laptop and the developing countries are all going to be really strong with mobile, uh, this is a marvelous opportunity to connect the world, to do a world of good, even attract more of it. We're, we're meeting face-to-face -face with clients right now on the African continent. We've done on the, on the Asian continent. We've met with people in China even a while back. And things are changing. Things are rapidly changing. And so um, I just want to bring you along with me. I'm a got three decades of experience in television, and this is my forte. This is television I'm doing right now. So anyway, let me just go ahead and share with you without further ado, I'll just show you, I'm going to do a screen share of my capability and you'll be able to see it yourself. Also, um, 
I invite you to look at my questions and answers, my Q&A panel here. If you have any questions, you can put your, in real time, you can actually enter your question and I can try to feel those questions during the event. Or if you don't get to it before the event, you can watch this as a YouTube video stream live and record it. And then I can, I'll be glad to answer or address any questions you have. I Maybe mean, raise some more. <laughs> uh, and also I have, uh, with the same panel over here, I actually have a showcase application that showcases the um, my my resources. So you can actually there's a link there that will actually go to my New World uh, Learning Institute and Conference Center. So anyway, I'm going to give you a little tour of it. I'm going to just help you give a guided tour using the screen share utility. So this is, if you visit newworldcom.com and you go to learning resources, you'll actually get to my New World Learning Institute and Conference Center pages. So what happens at a conference of any kind, whether it's a virtual only, a physical world only, or a hybrid world one, there are basically three major things that happen there, meaning three major components. One component is that people the community of the whole will meet in a giant auditorium. And so um, that's what uh, you can do, um, you know, uh, on, you know, online, you can actually meet online in a giant auditorium. And um, so that's really, really neat. Um, when you meet in an auditorium, you have a group of people that, uh, you know, can be like a panel discussion. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm going to go right to, this time I'm going to go right to my panel, and then I'll kind of tour right through those pages for you. So here we go. So here, here's uh, the auditorium. Uh, I'll go to the larger one, and you see that uh, you have the perception that you're actually on this page, that you are uh, streaming to a large audience. And um, this, the capacity is basically uh, virtually unlimited. If you consider that I can stream, I'm streaming publicly to people over. Um, Google Plus, which is the world's largest network. This is technology is embedded smack dab in the middle of Google Plus uh, as a platform. And so usually what happens there is that uh, people will um, hear the, the keynote speaker and a group of panelists. I can handle up to nine to 14 other endpoints with people at each endpoint. In this case, there would be individual panelists from across the planet. So the quality and the nature of the content can be way better. Even even some sub subject matter experts, uh, experts who can't physically be there can be part of the same presentation. And then uh, after that event is over, you kind of talk about what's going to happen for the next few days. By the way, we can do this over multiple days even. Um, they can then go to visit the New World Virtual Meeting Center, which is a concurrent meeting center, meaning that the meetings can happen at the same time. This is showing up to um, 14 different concurrent breakout sessions that can happen with smaller groups all at the same time. But they don't even have to be smaller groups. Um, these can be hangouts, which are limited to up to nine, uh, nine to 14 other virtual endpoints. Um, but they also can be hangouts on there themselves, which can stream to large audiences if there's a lot of popular demand for that. And the events, you can get to these events by going to a calendar, which would then allow you to go and actually drop right into the room. Uh, so you don't get lost and uh, so here's a metaphor that looks like a hotel conference here, but this is all virtual. So you, there are no costs involved if you're doing this virtual only to a hotel or to a convention center. Then um, after, uh, you know, you, you might take a break and then, you know, 
go down the hall for 15 minutes and take say three of these you know do like a, um, a series of three courses right before lunch then after lunch you could go to um, actually a new world virtual exhibition hall here's the metaphor for that there's a picture kind of of a physical world one but you see a crow's eyes view of of virtual booths and virtual booths would be essentially occupied by virtual exhibitors who would all be trained and empowered to meet face to face with people visiting their booth we also have a service where we uh, produce short clips that encourage people to visit exhibitors at particular booths uh, and so the virtual booth Here's a kind of a concept of that would allow you to meet face to face with people across the planet. Um, and the ability to present slides like I'm doing here or, or, or tour a website or show videos, uh, you know, just, you know, um, even order, transact business online by sending them to an e commerce link is all a possibility. So uh, that is just amazing. Um, so how do you get there? I want to show you with other some other lead learning resources um, that will help you and your organizations get there in a very neat way. You don't immediately we don't say immediately go out because people don't have an experiential reference for using this technology in a, in a qualitative way. So what we have developed is a series of resources. This is our learning resources area. One of the things we use is our New World Television channel, which is a YouTube channel to, like I'm using right now, I'm actually recording a YouTube video to educate people. And then we have a series of workshops and courses, um, two that are probably ap apropos. One is using uh, Google Plus to grow your business. Google Plus is the network that allows you to do Hangouts on Air and Hangouts. And we also have another course call using YouTube video to grow business and we use both of those technologies uh, for groups of people to begin as their first step to what we call walking through the virtual door then we also have a special course we call it the campaign course which is a actually a 12-month remote consultancy that uses these tools over say 12 months that, uh, that month 12 can culminate in a world-class virtual conference and trade show well step one is getting enabled that that involves you meeting face to face and learning how to do that in a qualitative way over Google Plus Hangouts and um, and then we introduce in step two how we can you can actually do business meetings we actually use the platform to plan the conference with you and to educate and train and empower. Then we also uh, get social. We actually use this, this is a social platform, way better than any other social uh, platform than you can imagine because of the integration of all the Google resources that are just amazingly powerful. People don't understand the power yet because it's like TV, it took 50 some odd years just to discover some of the possibilities of TV. We're only just discovering some of the marvelous possibilities of, you, of, of Google Plus integrated with YouTube and other um, Google resources. But we're going to be social. We'll actually be doing this in the physical world. We'll be streaming from restaurants and um, engaging people in a physical world way, in a hybrid world way at the same time, doing virtual happy hours even. We'll be using YouTube video to grow business. And we've taught people in that in our course, and we'll be leveraging that. We'll do a series of um, videos. We'll also have virtual business casuals, which we talked about before. We will. We are doing right now a series of critical conversations for a 21st century world using YouTube. These are really high-powered topics of interest to people across the planet. We'll be doing virtual boot camps around month six, which is like a rehearsal for the for a trade show. In a conference but without the exhibit hall and then finally culminate that with a conference and trade show so I'm gonna go ahead and stop the our sharing and I'm, I'll be back here um, you know back to, uh, on my um, 
on my case here. Um, I just really want to encourage you to ask me questions um, because a lot of people just as a as a kind of a as creatures of habit have kind of a fear or or, or, or misperception or lack of understanding of how great this is as an additive component not taking nothing away um, if you are planning a uh, again if you're planning a physical world conference but you can't justify the cost of paying all that hotel just for a few people to come in I can get more people maybe at a little lesser rate to attend your conference that can still happen your physical world thing then once your physical world of thing becomes so natural and so easy and so affordable there are no costs virtually hard and you know other than the cost of me training you and maybe uh, or having me orchestrate your conference for you there are no costs involved there's no hotel you don't have to feed people you can uh, work out a deal with um, you know with uh, some of the coffee companies like a Starbucks or Panera Bread to as part of the registration fee to have a coupon to get a a scone. <laughs> There's all kinds of wonderful possibilities here. And we are consultants. We can tailor fit this experience exactly to what you and your organization need. And then, of course, once you're trained and empowered with it, there's so many ways that you can use this technology to grow your business, whether it's a small business, a nonprofit, a government agency, um, a large nation state, even. This is a very scalable technology. And we're leveraging our 30 years of, of uh, consulting and marketing communications and television and learning to make this absolutely a marvelous experience for everyone involved. So I really want to thank you so much for um, in, letting me introduce you to the New World Learning Institute and Conference Center. And please, um, again, look at uh, ask some questions and uh, and call me. Uh, NewWorldCom.com is the name of my company, New World Communications, and we have a free consultation if you, for you and another group of key people from your organization. If we were to charge you for this, this, <laughs> this could be about 800 bucks. We're doing it for free just so we can raise your, make you aware of what we're doing and how valuable it can be to you for rocketing your your organization and your business forward. Thank you so much.